we have Angel Pacheo and Hal Pacheo versus Callan Logren. Uh, and Hell seven and two. He's four and one his last five, and he's coming off that decision loss to Danny Silva, who beat Josh Coolibao, I think two weeks ago. Callan Logren eight and one, four and one in his last five as well. He's coming off that decision loss against Taylor Lapalus. If we check the odds for this fight, we see that Callan's a minus three fifty favorite. So I understand why. You know, I I understand why. I I think that before. I saw the odds, Callan Logren, man, 350. This guy just lost his last fight. I mean, it's, it seemed kind of sketchy to me, the odds. However, just looking back into the tape and more research, I see why he's minus 350 now. I mean, I, I think that he is the side for this matchup. I feel like he, the UFC, they're giving him a good matchup with Angel here. Uh, Angel Pacheo, he lost his Dana White Contender Series fight and is now making his UFC debut, right, technically, coming off a loss. So I know that he survived and, you know, he didn't get knocked out by Danny Silva, but there were instances during that matchup where he was more like a punching bag and just absorbing every single shot. I mean, look at this, 13.6 absorb per minute. That's a lot of strikes. Uh, he also dished out, obviously, but 35% take, 35% striking defense, you know, not a good percentage. So this guy's there to get hit. And also, his takedown defense is not that great either. This guy gets taken down as well. I mean, let's look at the odds for the fight. Right now, Callan Lauren, he's like minus 350 again. I mean, I understand why. Um, I don't think that Cal, I don't think that in hell is going to be able to deter Callan in this matchup. He, Callan's going to be the more dangerous fighter. He has the physical advantages here with the strength. I just don't think that Angel is dangerous enough to really deter Callan from aggressively striking or grappling. So he's going to be a punching bag. There you get hit, little to no defense. I do think that Angel is tough. So I'm going to give him Callan via decision. It's going to be my pick. However, I can even see a finish. I, I just think that being tough and absorbing damage is not is a good thing until it's not until that chin goes and i think he's going to take some damage during this fight because callan is going to come back especially after that last loss i mean he he was matched up with a treat pretty tricky matchup against taylor lapilus who's a ufc vet at this point i mean he's coming off his second stint so this is the second time the ufc lapilus kind of out vetted callan in the last matchup and i feel like callan's gonna come out here pretty amped up looking to go for the finish so Pick here is Callum by decision, but I can see a finish. Um, I would say he's parlay safe uh, to to put in parlay. I think I'm pretty high on Callum this week.